Oh, this takes me back. Yay! Right. Welcome, Lychee! Welcome back. Hi, Lychee. Alright. I have no idea how to play this. That's alright. We it's have Stephanie weird. here, therefore you're all kinds of set. <laughs> you're beyond ready. Exciting. It's very exciting so far. Thank you. So there are some original voices Ooh, from the show in this game. Very oh. exciting. Oh, it was just Tracy followed me on Twitter, you guys. I did. I found you. <laughs> oh no, Buffy the Vampire Slayer? Is this a terrible game? No, it's a very good game, but we, we have to make sure we're not missing the exposition. Should I turn it up or? I mean, we're missing the entire story right now. <laughs> there we go. Like, we've got to find out what we're supposed to do. You have to find out your mission. Well, what's your motivation, Chess? Slay vampires. That's your job. You sure? Yes. This is exciting. In every generation, uh -oh. there is a chosen one. It's like a cool commercial. I wonder if she was on fire and then was like, yeah. Oh. Buffy does not you care. Crawl okay. Ready to go. Yeah. Kill all the things, Buffy. You can probably <laughs> press button and skip the rest of this if you wanted to. If you but wanted I don't know to. why you would want to, to be fair. Oh, there it goes. Get a feel for it. I remember the uh, the random uh, female vampires that attack you are pretty pretty awesome. <laughs> Dr. I mean, Girdo says, I'm sure... <laughs> I'm sure Stephanie could tell you exactly what's going on based solely on the costume. <laughs> you know, you probably want to start a new game on hard... Uh, just to um, get used to it, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. There's a save game from You Pick VG3, The Battle of the Birthdays. Uh, so you could continue that one if you want, or you can start a new game. Up to you. I think you started a new. Yes, yeah. we did. <laughs> on yeah. on hard. Yeah. Right. The clock's hey. off. The clock's off. Yeah. Oh, oh, hers. So oh wow. As far as the is concerned. Sunnyvale is on a very uh, special time zone. Bored. All right. So make yeah, sure well, you, yeah. you, you watch all the subtitles here so you know what you're doing. This is like a bad Tomb Raider. <laughs> it's like a bad Tomb Raider? I think you mean it's like a good Tomb Raider. The best Tomb Raider. I mean, Raider. I can't yeah. speak to the controls. They're not great. <laughs> those There's are some really great leaves. Look at this. those. Yeah. Some of the voice acting is <laughs> terrible. <laughs> Even the ones who are the actual actors, because they kind of phone it in. That jump. That's a good jump. That's, like that uh, is Anthony awesome. Like Stewart head there as Giles <laughs> kind of phoned it in. You gotta, I think you have to jump from one ledge to the other. Uh, uh, that looks like it takes a lot of skill. Uh, that's about how I felt yesterday. Probably will be in a couple hours too, but right now I have to push through and do pro <coughs> homework. Oh. Cool kids don't do homework. Right, guys? <laughs> I can't <laughs> I say that. I don't think Chloe Why'd you high five gets to high-five you for that. <laughs> Why would you high-five me for that? I Chloe's have students. Tutor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What, what's wrong with you? Chloe sits down and makes kids do their homework. With yes. Her. <laughs> like, I have multiple students who only keep me on as a tutor because if they didn't, they would never do their homework. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, puzzle! Yay! First puzzle, first puzzle, you guys. Good stuff. Oh, and now you pressed a button, which apparently takes your whole upper body strength, despite the fact that you're the chosen one, and uh, therefore should have lots <coughs> of that. Yeah. We talked about it. Be the chosen one, instantly gain martial arts powers. Uh, this could come in handy. Not, no, becoming a vampire. Oh, becoming a vampire, you sorry. Oh, vampirism yeah, gives you kung fu powers. Oh. Like, she has super strength, but all of her... Like martial arts and stuff, you have to learn from her watcher. Right. Yes. yes. Oh man. Oh, hey. fact number one. That's what we'll do. Instead of a death count, we'll do a Stephanie spewing up Buffy facts. <laughs> but there's a very fun Great. space fact in the chat for you. What? Yeah. A space do this. Fact? Fill I probe on the comet. I can't pronounce that. Has uh -oh, broken uh -oh. up. Finally. Yeah, guys. That time we landed. Oh, that thingy. That's comet. awesome. And then its solar panels were had dust on them, so we were worried it might never wake up. It woke up! It did, yes. It got 
close enough to the sun for some more energy. That's yes. almost as good as cat facts. Oh, and I the bet lander I know where you need to put yes, that. Yes, they do. All of the landers tweet. It's wonderful. What a time to be alive. <laughs> My favorite uh, oh. pro I think Twitter account put that is Cassidy, the thing. which is the door around uh, Saturn. Love I would have Saturn. figured it out on my own. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm really I, I have really faith in puzzles, you. Okay? I have so much faith in you. I really do. You can do it. You can do it. You're the chosen one. You are the slayer. <laughs> I, I want to know how you set up a robot on a distant comet to tweet. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you get like a, uh, a weapon that shoots spears or something? That is exactly how you get a robot on a distant cam- comet to tweet. Right here for... Uh-oh. What's cool is that NASA actually that has these things called NASA socials, and as long as you have a social there. media account, you can apply uh, to go to one, and you can meet the people who yeah. do yeah. the Twitters yeah. and um, the science for the NASA's. You can go to Mars. I met the robot. I didn't go to Mars, though. I met Curiosity. I saw it in its clean room in at the Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena, yeah. California, at the NASA social. So I have gone to six of them. Pointing. You yeah, have met the me. space nerd. Um, but yes, they're very cool. You should check it out. Uh, I believe you can just do a Google search for NASA social. Hey. And pretty much right. anyone can apply. Uh, and right. they randomly select people who just come into NASA facilities, secure NASA facilities, and get tours and get free okay. stuff. And I'll give you the whole thing. Yeah. NASA people. Nice. Sometimes cool celebrities, because sometimes celebrities apply. When I, the time I went to Kennedy Space Center, I was there with Seth Green and LeVar Burton. And only 130 other people or so. Stop so. Now first. But that's actually a small number of people to be there with. Seth Green took a selfie with me. Because, uh, yeah. Hey, that. At the time, I was representing a company and I had the mascot with me. And he wanted a picture with me and the mascot. But I'll take it. Well done, Buck. Oh, crap. Dr. Girdo says. To Seth Green is in oh, crap. <laughs> Dr. Girdo says, that guy has big pointy ears. These aren't vampires, these are elves. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Gary's night, I got some deep one of the contestants from the Mars mission. Nice, Mars wow. one. I, a friend of mine is married to one of them. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> and he said that he yeah. didn't mind that if she you do that for the rest of the game, that'd be never, spectacular. Ever gonna happen. <laughs> so he's like, yeah, I'm not really worried about my wife running off to Mars. I don't think I'm it's gonna really happen. But he encouraged her to apply. So, uh, Dialin from Mars talking about uh, using giant knitting ne- needles to make rugs out of old t-shirts, which that's lovely. Yes. That's totally a thing I would do. Yes. I've never used the really giant knitting needles. I think, like, the giant the size of a nickel around <laughs> is the biggest I've used. The right. giant crochet hooks that are about this big, way more fun than giant knitting needles. Mm. I'd get as far as buying them and really thinking hard about maybe doing it eventually and then just... <laughs> <laughs> never touching them again? Never touch. Yeah, I'll just have them. I have a violin I've never touched. Okay. Why? I don't know. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Uh, the chair. Yes. Yeah, if you were to get wooden ones, then you could have knitting needles that, like, you could make a rug out of a t-shirt and you can kill some vampires, so. Yeah. I imagine Buffy owns several of those. Now, Stephanie, in this universe, does it have to be a wooden stake to kill a vampire, or Um, if you had, like, a a shard of a stop sign? So, yeah, it it has to be wood, or, so, in the Buffyverse, it's wood. (coughs) to the heart, or decapitation, or fire, um, and also fire by sunlight. So if they're in the sun for too long, they'll catch fire and combust. So that's why at some point in this game she can throw, um, she can throw hellfire at them to catch them on fire, or Willow, I think, has a spell to generate a tiny sun that burns them up. I feel Don't forget like holy water. <laughs> yes, holy water you can you throw okay? at them, but it won't kill them. It'll hurt them. <laughs> Crosses will hurt them, especially if they touch their skin. Alright, um, check the But it won't kill them. Now, instead the of creating... Decapitation's the favorite. Instead of creating a miniature sun, could they just use, like, a UV lamp? On I the would vampires? think so. question. Right? Like in, like in the, uh, the Blade universe? Which I guess is the Marvel universe? Yeah. They never really tackled that in the show, I'm gonna be honest. Have well, no sun probably right in some bad fanfic. <laughs> uh, it's like down, up, Y, B, X, and then you have the ten moves through this Exactly. I think you need about twelve fingers to make it happen. This oh. tutorial. Earlier, real quick, there was a there was a key on a table he had to get, and to get it, you, you had to actually get on top of the cable and pick it up instead of just standing next to it. That seems like. But do a you think you had to do that, or do you think that that was just Nighthawk style? Uh, you know, it could be either. I think it was both. Yeah, a little bit of both. Okay. So Whoa. I'll be curious Ooh. to see. You have to Some solve the puzzle fog. to unlock that door. 
Am I looking at the puzzle? Uh, oh, that's a good question. Tip: Pick up the stone key and place it in the niche. Uh, <laughs> d does a crucifix have to be specifically created to be a holy implement, or can I just cross two butter knives and repel vampires? Uh, in the show, it seems like you can just make your own cross because things like Buffy has a cross oh, necklace. Ain't gonna happen. And so I'm sure that some cross necklace that was bought at a store was probably not actually blessed by anyone or anything. So I would think you could make a cross, but they never do it. You see, Leishamon says that it has to be blessed, but I'm not sure that's true. Because, like, yeah, she just wears a giant honking 90s cross. <laughs> and it's funny because sometimes she'll hug Angel and it'll burn into him okay. in the show. Still which not is so there. dumb. Okay, what if I Did had a frying pan? Wrong? And I just like drew a cross on there with a sharpie, and it's blessed. It's supposed to go. Like, I, I mean, if blessed, it was blessed, a blessed frying pan with a cross written on it, I just smacked it. <laughs> I'll tell you, Father Pete, who was here yesterday, gave me a wonderful wedding gift of a um, a bottle of holy water that he blessed himself. Okay. That's awesome. Uh, for for our wedding. That's awesome. So I have because he and I are both Buffy fans, so he knew I would appreciate <laughs> having holy water that he made himself for me to fight yes. vampires. Maybe he's trying to tell you that vampires are real, and uh, his order, you know, fights them. Yeah. Yeah, hey. that's what we've learned today. Also, I feel the first time I met him, I didn't realize he was uh, a, a priest or a parochial vicar, and uh, I may have made a lot of big jokes. Yeah, we usually don't tell people. We just see <laughs> it's kind of funny. It's 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 a little bit funny to see them find out later. Especially yeah. especially <laughs> me raised Catholic later. I was like, oh no, I'm right. Right. I found <laughs> out when I added him on Facebook. Touching. Because I went through Whoa. our mutual yeah. friends and was like, oh, uh, look, there's Stephanie, there's Grant, there's Father Tom, <laughs> Father David. Um, I think there's something going on here. Uh, awesome. <laughs> you are not bones. Shoot him in the junk. Shoot him in the junk. Oh. Is that a shotgun and we it's a crossbow. Are it, it's a snake for rifle. Right now, I'm refreshing to be sure. You're <laughs> sitting at just nine dollars away from thirty-eight hundred. Really Ooh. bothers me. It bothers me that like it's not a round, even, nice number, and I just donated, so I can't fix it. Okay. But you can. Yeah, nine dollars. I'm blaming Hannah Montana. She donated six dollars. She should have donated fifteen. <laughs> yep. She should have. Um, you could do nine dollars okay. to Jackie Chan's stuntmaster. Uh, you, you That's a horrible game. Nine. You get it. You need a little bit more than that to get it in the top five. Uh, you see, you could do fifty nine. to thirty eight fifty. You could probably do thirty four. That would bring us to thirty eight twenty five. Okay. If you did thirty four, you could get a I game in the fourth time. place. Any game. Uh, any game you want. Keys, awesome. right? And, uh, yeah, three keys. Yeah, it's three keys. Oh. But yeah, yeah, 50. Yeah. Plus a bonus, four dollars. 59 would get any game, any game, into what number one. Give it a three X multiplier on the wheel. And uh, bring us to a nice round. No! <laughs> no! I want to hear that. I want to see it. One of the stone keys. Yeah, I got that stone key. What about the stone key? Are there more stone keys? Have you found all of them? He, uh, they're he like just the said maps. one of the stone keys, yeah, so that, there must be more. Wait, did you check in the fountain? There's always keys in the fountain. Yeah, Daybreakers also nope. had Willem Dafoe. Time to move on. Yeah, Daybreakers was a really great concept, but I think they didn't do a good job with it. But uh, what's that? Two. That should be me. The terrible yeah. Buffy movie that doesn't really two. exist had um, <laughs> Donna Sutherland. <laughs> so it did. Yeah. yeah. You don't talk about that. About? Oh. Oh, yes, that. Sassy was that Buffy. Christy Swanson? I don't even know. When do I get that Hungamunga thingy? The Hungamunga? Perry. Jumbo Wumba? Jumbo Wumba? <laughs> <laughs> I Wombo get knocked combo. down, but I get up again. I don't know how it goes. Alright. Yes, Christy Swanson, you're right. Have you tried setting oh. it to Wombo? Uh, also, Hillary Swank. SpongeBob Joe! Yes. SpongeBob Joe! <laughs> <laughs> so would be for the SpongeBob Joe! <laughs> <laughs> Un aggressively, un aggressively unpleasant. Yes, aggressively unpleasant cheerleader best friend of Buffy who didn't understand why Buffy was suddenly acting so weird. What an aggressively unpleasant. Um, I don't remember what we said. Cheerleader. Sure, let's do that. Right. Oh, Did it? Duh. 
Gotta follow him. As much as I don't like the movie, I do know things about it. Oh, what's going on? Where the floor tiles look new. According to an arcane text I found, I should be. No one knows. There was no Buffy movie. It's very sad. We deserve one. To break through the tile. We Here deserve we a second season of Firefly. Uh, we deserve a lot of things out of Joss Whedon. We really do. But the man only works on 12 projects at once. I heard that from his own lips. <gasps> he promised me an enchilada once, and he has not delivered. He told my mother that he and I were getting married. That's yeah, fascinating. And it really up to everyone. And yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for that. Waiting for that for both. My right. random enchilada crap means right. nothing I, now. Uh... I, I don't appreciate you promising my mother things that you didn't deliver on, Joss. She's very upset now. Before he deleted his Twitter. Right, so. That's right. <laughs> a good action right there. I came in like a wrecking bell. <laughs> I was a puppy. Miley Cyrus joke. It's so appropriate. They make a lot of those. Also, he's talking to you after you fell down a hole. So that's... Do you Giles, like, is this really training? How did you even set all this up? Like, <laughs> we're going to go to the old Spanish mission where I have created a Ruth Goldberg style mystery puzzle thing uh, full of oh, vampires oh, to kill you. There's so many holes in this building. Giles is the second worst watcher ever. Ooh. Only second worst? Well, Wesley was a worse watcher. Okay, fair. Which one was Wesley? Uh, he was he, the watcher who was bad, right? Yeah, he was the watcher who was bad. Yeah, there you nice. go. He was in season three of Buffy and then all five seasons of Angel where he was no longer a watcher and became I awesome. change weapons. Became pretty much the best character in both shows. And fight me if you don't believe that's true. Let's go. Let's do it. Fight. Let's do it. Let's bring right. it. He was a terrible watcher. Lorne. Whoa. Lorne was two. great, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, Lorne and Wesley together were Back attack. Yes. Double dragon. Nice. God, Whoa. season five of Angel was the best season of your show. Good times. Oh my god. Yeah. Lauren, Spike, uh, Wesley, uh, uh, Angel as a puppet, <laughs> Fred, <laughs> Valeria. So good. Was that a comment on David Boreanaz's uh, acting? Because I will fight you. No, he literally became a puppet. I know. <laughs> well, yeah, Jimmy was asking if that was a comment on, on David Boreanaz's acting. No, he became a puppet. Oh, Buffy's training here is better than the Karate Why Kid's training. Yes, he was, <laughs> and um, you know what? the episode was named I Smile Time. I'm, I'm with so Dr. Zara. So that when you have spike or kill it, a curve time. Right. Because if you can successfully be a puppet. Right. He was yep. a puppet so. and a man in the same. And <laughs> he's a puppet Why is and he's a lost man. Well, not really a man. No, a vampire. Right? A vampire man. Press B to eat worms. <laughs> Please catch this fly with these chopsticks. Yes. Buffy's training here is better than Karate Kid. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> right, I mean, Giles actually has her fighting vampires. I guess that is better Where than... Where did he find them? He was like, hey, you guys are going to die. Well, that's what we were talking about. <laughs> Just like, how did he lure them in there? Although we have seen amazing. in the now show that vampires are so dumb that, wow. like, you tell them the Slayer's going to be somewhere and they will go there. <laughs> they won't go away, like, where they might not get killed by the Slayer. They're like, they have this bravado thing going on where they're like, I'm going to be the one that kills the Slayer. Are they all old or are they, like, new vampires? Usually it's new vampires who make that mistake. I mean, I just, that makes sense. new vampires right? new vampires that are around for a while. Old vampires either don't make that mistake or they are Spike and they killed two killers. Kill Poo to teach about life and patience. Buffy just needs to learn how to kill some... Very accurate. Yes, right. accurate. Kill right. some more Buffy has to stay alive and kill. Uh -oh. That's She doesn't have to, like, really learn a life lesson. She, she was trained to kill, she does. period. Sometimes she does. Sometimes. Everything's on fire now. Yeah, where did Giles get all this fire? Like, what is he doing? What is he spending? He's supposed to be a librarian. He has a job. Isn't he, isn't he a little bit he magic or something? Job. He has two jobs, the librarian and the watchers Whoa, to pay him. Ooh, that's the creepy. watchers council. He has two jobs and yet somehow that's time to like build wacky fire pits in Spanish missions. <laughs> Good God, Giles. Imagine you're just life. talking to a sea of undead creatures, like, okay, so you're gonna be in the walls and reach out and be creepy, and you guys over here will pop up through the floor, so it'll be great. And you're gonna be a gyroscope. <laughs> yeah, he's like the producer Whoa. of the play. So was Angel a Muppet of a man or a manly Muppet? <laughs> What's the matter, Slayer? Mashup. Why not both? 
feel like that's actually like a really high tier question. It is. I'm it thinking is. about it really hard. In the words of Fred in that episode, you're, oh wait, no, it's Spike, Spike who says, <laughs> you're a bloody puppet. That's what he was. You <laughs> we little puppet man. Right. <laughs> so, well, and then oh, Fred, oh. Fred was like, put your little the whole hands thing was a dream. in your little hair. She dreamed about training. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's how he set it Her up. Her reaction it was, was the best. It's a dream. No, I'm is, is actually a, like, kind of surprised at the quality of the facial right? yeah. animations. Yeah, like when was this What's game? What did I do with the case? Let's kill something. Mm. <laughs> Let's kill something. Does Buffy have parents? She has a mother and a sister who magically appears in like the second episode. Yeah, so she doesn't yet have a sister. Um, and not this, this the second episode, no, the first episode of the fifth season. Thank the sister you. magically appear, appears, but and everyone's everyone's like, oh, she's been here the whole time. Buffy's like, I don't know who this person is. Not exactly, but yeah. Okay. Pretty <laughs> I'm gonna go with my my barely remembered summaries of the show that I've gotten from you. That's pretty good. Thank you. Uh, this was 2002. Okay. Actually, a little bit less impressed with it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this wasn't 1997. Like, came out in 2002. What else came out in 2002? Was that um, Perfect Dark? What are the contemporaries to Buffy? The, oh, Bleachy Mods got it about the same time I did. Um, what are oh, some contemporary games from 2002? Uh, Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Oh, okay, so Was Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Salt Lake 2002. <laughs> the Salt Lake City Olympic tie-in game. Vice City uh, had better backgrounds. Morrowind. Hey. But Mar- I don't Scratch remember. Mm-hmm. Oh. So dark. I don't know. Well, Morrowind had like that, that kind of weird Why is there a stick in the high school? <laughs> the Why are there vampires in high school? That's the eyes not really looking at you. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. bring that up. Jim, all over the place. I know. Also, Kingdom Hearts came out in 2002. Really? Oh, that's hard to see on the projector, sadly. Whoa, whoa, what's going on there? Angel is a puppet. <laughs> oh, so he literally becomes a little puppet. Oh, he yeah. does. What yeah. did you think we were talking about? I thought about? you meant like you metaphorically, like he's a tool of the darkness really or something. No, he's a muppet. A literal muppet. That's really strange. Yeah, Hunto just put that in chat. All right, I'm going to have to see that at some point. Yeah. You should. It's a funny episode. As I said, Jimmy, that's the only episode of Angel I've ever seen. That's the best season of Angel 2. That's season 5, the final season, but... Sadly, it's the best season, but you'll get the most out of it only if you've watched all of Buffy and all of Angel. So never watch that season. Yes. Get it. Yes. Oh, but I highly recommend those shows can't if you have anything. a yeah, lot of time. Can we uh, pop the brightness up on this TV, or is that uh, I mean, you can, yeah. Um, but if this game is dark, isn't it meant to be dark? No, it's uh, not. Oh, yeah, that was bad. Uh, ooh. I like this game better. Yeah. <laughs> Movie it's dynamic. It's funny because no. on the stream it just looks like Nighthawk is still playing. They can't see the menu uh, next uh, to me. So. Yeah. <laughs> oh no no, go yeah, back to uh, the thingy. Uh, yeah. Menu. I mean, it's just dark. Put it back on <laughs> standard. And then and this, go to the yeah, back. He appears to be staring into blackness in general. Standard. Backlight. Mm-hmm. That even help? No. I, I can't see anything. A little bit. All right, just live with it. Yeah, let's just try I mean, to. You can see from the. I'm icon gonna put the backlight back to what it was. Like it was it twelve, is. I think. Try to press on. Yeah. Uh, uh, You're just helps. in the school at night. That's all. But it's scary. I don't know if I said this before, but I'll be interested to see if Nighthawk gets further in his hour than I got in my hour. Wait, this has been played before. Uh, it was played in the last year's marathon, the <laughs> Battle of the Birthdays. What do you? You have a stage. It was the first, the second oh. game that came out. It was early on. Yeah. It was in the Was that your friend? <laughs> it was one of my teachers. Uh, yeah, I think it was. Oh. A dead I'm thinking there'd be a lot of questions. No more teachers, no more books. Wait, he just said don't, pencils. like no more Homer Simpson. Yes, he just said don't. That was amazing. Yeah, they say stupid things. Someone wrote this Unless it's a direct reference, which is even funnier. <laughs> Sensation that's sweeping the nation. Oh my god, because he has a problem. Oh my god. <coughs> Show me, Sand the Car. Show me, give me ten bucks. Put shoe on head. Oh man. So, in what hour of the morning did Goldeneye and Sonic and Knuckles end up getting oh, well, played? Was Goldeneye was at uh, 8 o'clock. That was my first shift. It was a lot of fun. We played um, We played the Soon Bean uh, Nut Slapper Hour. Groin Slapper. Uh, no, every, you know, you crouch down, slappers only, one hit kills. A lot of fun. In yeah. Goldeneye, I can't remember, does, can you play, like, can everyone play a Sean Bean? 
No. Unless no. you unless yeah. you're cheating. Usually I grab Sean Bean first. Because I'm gonna die a lot. <laughs> so um Nighthawk brought up an interesting point. Uh, he said he missed Goldeneye, and yes he did miss some Goldeneye, but any game can be played again. But it'll have to be donated for again. So yes, Sherman, you missed Goldeneye and Sonic and Knuckles this morning. But <laughs> you know, donate for him again. Stay home today. Oh, she's home. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what she said when we stabbed her. Um, we can always watch the replay. Um, oh, that's a... Can't wear hats is back. Welcome back for some mad night. Kill me, knows too much. So, when did Sonic and Knuckles get played? Uh, I played it at, during my shift at 4 yesterday. And that was fun. I think Schumann was still around for that one. Oh. Oh no, you still got it. Or yeah. not yet around? You must have been around for that. Oh, uh, here we're at Staming. Staming um, kill. I don't, yeah, I don't know if it got played during the night. Actually, I can look. What up, cat card? We have to. We have to. <laughs> That's how the Google Docs work. Can't win, Slayer. Oh, the oh no! Small <laughs> tops in the school. Hey, oh, you can't wear oh, hats. Can I ask why you cannot wear hats? Are you a lizard? <laughs> I would, I would say just listen to it. You're a snake person. She said ass. That's not appropriate. Those are hate words. We just want to be treated with kindness. Let that be a lesson to you. Or, you know, those who pass by your name, of course. Yeah, she was says he donated again. So I'm looking up when... Uh, Can't wear hats. Sarah may or may not be a snake person. Yeah, Chip was here. What time? No, was I that? wasn't here. Nice. Oh no! But I got the play by play. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna be with one hundred percent snake person. Real quick, the morning, there's a, um, which a flaming trash can inside the school over there, which is interesting to me. Because you're in Mountain okay. Time. Is that what Colorado is? Revealing locations of people. <laughs> See, right, there's a, that's just, that's really unsafe, guys. And if those guys have any chocolate in their lockers, it's going to melt and get all over their books. Yeah. Which Yay. might also be on fire. That, that just gets trash really? Yeah, it was played in the 5 a.m. hour. When I was in middle school, I used to keep packets of ketchup in my locker. Uh, Shuma says, anyway, I might donate again at some future point, but I have a budget constraint that I'm running up against. And then made that awesome, scared, sad face icon that you can do on Twitch. Um, Colorado is mountain time. Two hours by behind y'all biscuit heads. They cut the power. We are biscuit heads. We are biscuit heads. That is a Mewtwo sweater. About this person from Pennsylvania. No, that's a early 2000s black cat sweater. Dude, no, that's Mewtwo. I know my Pokemon. That's a Mewtwo. That's Pokemon. It's a Mewtwo. Here, take this. I have that sweater. That's a very Willow sweater too. Is that who that is? Huh? Yeah, I think it was me too. You should know. Says, so unless it gets a little low budget in here, I'm gonna have to hope someone else wants to see Sonic and Knuckles. Well, I mean, if you can get it close to the top five, that usually like encourages someone to try and push it. Why is she over. here? Oh, she's scared. She's in her classroom that only hosts four and students at a time. Close to the top five would take less very small than schools. Twenty dollars. Oh, 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 no. I'm sorry. Six students at a time. Denied. I mean, she's hiding from the vampires, right? I believe where Hat says that he has a large head or and most hats don't fit him. Why is that sort of yeah. form fit into our brand? Well, well, you see, the style of the 90s was to just To glue swell. the middle of your sweater down so that it always <laughs> stayed attached to your sternum. Yes, sweater. Actually, that was the 90s style. Everyone in this game is just wearing body paint. That's, that's the thing. Things I think I missed that part. Right. Tight up top. Well, even if it was tight, though, there would be that... Well, I mean, it, I, it's... Anyway, um, <laughs> you know, it kind of becomes unibus in a sweater because it stretches. And I think the hers is like glued down. Well, yeah, but Willow's is like glued to her sternum. Whoa. So I don't know how she did that, but <laughs> sweater glue. No, you're gonna turn into a vampire. Catcart says I actually had no idea how many vampires. There are actually multiple Buffy games. I think there are six or so. A couple for DS uh, and two for the games. Xbox or PlayStation 2. Do you have them? I have the two Xbox ones. 
which is this one oh. and Buffy the Vampire Slayer Start Chaos all the way back Beans, here. <laughs> which I have played all of. I haven't played all of this one. Thank you, Moobot. Yes, to enter to win this scarf, do what Moobot said in the chat, which is follow us and send us a message saying you want the scarf. The first Buffy game was actually for Game Boy Color in 2000. And the most recent in 2009, Buffy the Vampire Slayer Sacrifice for Nintendo DS. It was so informative. 2009. By Beast Studios. Beast. No, 2009. So that was six that years after the show was canceled. <laughs> they made another Buffy Whoa, game. Mr. Uh, their clothes are made of marzipan and it's shaped to their bodies, says <laughs> Lichy Mods. And Dr. Yoda says, oh, that's unfortunate. I'm allergic to almonds. I guess I can't be a vampire. <laughs> well, nope. you also can't be a witch that fights vampires, because... Willow appears to be wearing that too. Everyone in Sunnydale wears the fashionable marzipan clothing. <laughs> Except Buffy. Well, Buffy's gotta fight vampires, alright? She's gotta wear, like, this is the most practical vampire fighting outfit I've ever seen Buffy in. It really she's is. She's in, like, track pants. Why are so many people at the school at night? It's whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, uh, no, they, they were in a uh, cheerleading practice. What? What is yeah, that move? Except teachers and parents do tonight. Oh. Um, but at this point in the <laughs> plot, who knows? There we go. Right. Everyone's in a good company now. At this point, yeah, there are lots of episodes oh, yeah. where, like, the student teacher oh, open house gets attacked or something, and you yeah. wonder how any one has this parents is. left. <laughs> had, had Sunnydale is run in terror yeah. by teachers yeah. now. <laughs> well, they die all the time too, so I think at this point it's being run by like ten year olds. <laughs> horrifying. Think about it. Ten year olds and then teenage girls. And a puppet. <laughs> no, he's in Los Angeles. It's funny, in the first episode of Buffy, Cordelia refers to Sunnydale as a one Starbucks town. <laughs> to which I'm like, oh, honey. I mean, he's right there. That's not a school. <laughs> Small towns have one traffic light, if you're lucky. I think, I think Twilight, Twilight is showed us anyone can be a vampire. Okay, I think Twilight really? showed us that we really need Buffy the Vampire Slayer, <laughs> but as a literature, like a publisher, some sort of person who has the gatekeeping power to like books being right. published, like that's Buffy's true die. way to like fight bad vampires. Right, I guess a friendly. Okay, we're gonna highlight them. that guy's really sacky. I can't die. I can't die like this. He <laughs> said, Play the devil may cry, Jabba. Acting. Such acting. Oh, oh, that was that was synchronized. I loved it. We have just 15 minutes till Buffy the next the wheel spin. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Stay tuned for Buffy the Literature Slayer. Yeah, it's, it's a, a typing slide. game. I would oh, no, definitely play a Buffy typing long. game. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Such games were even required now. Someone suggested Mario teaches typing for this <laughs> marathon, but it didn't get very many votes, so oh. it only got that one vote. The quick red slayer jumps over the lazy vampire. <laughs> <laughs> right. That is a that was a good scream. That guy that guy was really swinging for fences on that one. Right. Doing a good job as a chosen one. Ain't gonna happen. Already died once. Not that chosen. <laughs> Nighthawk, you might have to speak up. You gotta let the people hear your your witty commentary. There's people. <laughs> yeah, there's uh like seven, twelve, thirty-two, 32. I think. So somewhere around thirty-two people. I can't count that. <laughs> well, it says over there it's three and two. So it's Talk loud to the blue thing. Oh, thirty-one. 32? I don't know. Doesn't matter. Never oh, there's a Mewtwo there. sweater again. She's here. This game, Buffy the Literature Slayer, Dawn of the Dead, Typing of the Dead. <laughs> Typing of the Dead. Is an actual game, like isn't it? Compar- is, this game okay, is to is Buffy the Literature Slayer as Dawn of the Dead is to Typing of the Dead. That <laughs> format <laughs> is something none of you us have this. had to deal with since. Stick and move. Spice. Stick and move. The SATs. So <laughs> Stick and move. Remember how to read that? Oh, oh yeah. See? That, that hairdo, yo. Yeah. Oh, nope, nope. Oh, I think she'll grab boobs. Oh, the, uh, the. Ooh, what? Yes. Yes. Multiple yeah. Multiple yeah. yes. Yes. little, like, buns on her head. Kick her while she's down. Yeah. yeah. Chloe, yo, yeah. Okay, so, 
figuring out the block button is like this a real game changer. Wait, did yeah. you never take the SAT? I mean, I did years ago that were multiple. I should at least be looking at like wallets and stuff. Yeah, and I mean, you, 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 you should always take them anyways in case you got bit, you know? Yeah, I think the part where I took oh, it before they introduced yes. the writing oh, get up, get up, was get the up. best part. Even though I'm sure I would have done well on that, I don't want to do it. <laughs> but I think you and I are the same. Yeah. No, see, when we took it, it would have been only two parts. You found the block just too. math and English. And oh, now there's an essay on top of that. Or did they get rid of it They're, they're going no, to. They're yeah, going yeah, to get rid of it. If they haven't already. Did they do an essay on the RSA? Yeah, I mean, I have like small mini essays. Yeah, they're cool. They're pieces too. The terrible multiple uh, ponytails were big things for vampires. Instant grab. No, I'm sorry. You got it, you got it. Just punch and block, punch and block. Oh no, punch and block. Just between. Step, step, step. One of you youngins in the chat told me what. The SAT essay is on now. Yeah, Dr. Gerdos, you're if you if you took the SAT instead of the ACT, um Yeah. yeah. You do you have a shock state? Tell us, because no, you're a bit you're a bit younger. Chloe well, uh, went to yeah. I hope take a nap. Yeah. So <laughs> you can't ask her, but she probably had to do the writing thing if she's young enough. That's it. There's no something really so just getting out of her dusting and one liner. That is all Buffy does. I know, that's um, you look when so you think funny. about it, like yeah. it's, sad, it's very. Nice. Like, there's something wrong. This is where they got the idea from And then man she hunt. gets sad when they don't like laugh like, uh, or react when she makes her pun <laughs> and stabs them in the show. It's pretty funny and scary. But you have to assume that years of killing might turn you into a sociopath. Yeah, and she's That's basically it. what happened with oh, Eliza Dushku's character, Faith. Is she uh, is also a slayer. That's cool. Don't ask how that happens. Uh, complicated, complicated. <laughs> but uh, then there's two of them, and yeah, face goes crazy yeah. and kills a man. A man, not a vampire. Whoa! Just a regular dude. Okay. Oh no! They so window like I crazy, the SAT man. Before they put in the writing component, but uh, I had to take the SAT to two writing tests. And I think a lot of other people did too. So it probably makes sense to merge it into the regular SAT. Maybe that's what our don't know. Why did you take the if SAT too in order to go to the No, no you're, I, I think you just have to start after left of that. The it you makes sure there was an areas. auto save after you left. I didn't have to take it. I got into our college. Please. Uh -huh, I did less Please. than you and got into the same Please. school. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just better. <laughs> and a more difficult program to get into. Suck it! Yes. Alright. Yes. Alright. Who do we have here? We have a vampire. Awesome. What do you think <laughs> it's going to be, Buffy? God. Dancing. Jeez. It's a clown! <laughs> <laughs> that move! Do that move the entire time. <laughs> if you get to fighting the weird dog creature that is like straight up Zool out of Ghostbusters, uh, you will have gotten as far as I did in your hour. Hi, Mayar. Mary? Mayari? Mayari. Mayari! 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 Get him, get him, get him. Oh, he killed old ladies? That's so mean. Oh, man. Hey, thanks, man. Mary says hi. She says, I took the SAT twice. Only improved my score by 10 points the second time. But was concerned about the fact that my verbal score on the first was so much higher than my math score. I'm not the chosen one. Um, you are the chosen one. You just have to stab more. I forget. Right. I mine were stab. ten points apart, stab. and I forget right. which one stab. I did better. Stab. Punch. Like, considering it's only stab. ten points <laughs> difference. AKA punch, one punch, question. stab, windmill, uh, stab. <laughs> because I am a CS major who does not care for math. Well, I'm well, a history major who doesn't care for teaching people stuff. Well, <laughs> I see it a lot. Well, I'm a film major who can't. <laughs> Just like Sam is an econ major who does not care for econ. <laughs> the joke only makes sense when <laughs> Sam is in the <laughs> chat. Don't wake him up. I don't I don't know if I should have his I should have his number. Wake him up so we can mock him. Today. I'm not gonna wake him up, he has a young child. Okay, so he's probably already awake. Let's call him. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, oh. I'm, I'm a fellow lady CS major. High I five. Punched him so hard he exploded. 
I think that implies that Cat Card thinks that Schumann is a lady. I'm not fine with that. I feel like a new slayer. We'll call we'll call Schumann Lady Schumann from now on. Alright, it's 2015. Shoe woman. Shoe woman. What is Schumann is? It does come from Schumann's last name, so Lady Schumann is just Schumann's sister. Oh, I'm not a lady. I should clarify that. But oh. I am a sister. <laughs> Apparently it's true. Even if friendly. Schumann was a female, Schumann would not be a lady. Can you find that? She's a lady. She's a lady. Oh. I originally thought that what's her name was saying it. Oh no. Then I saw chat. No, I was uh, referring to Schumann's CS majorness. So are Sorry. you? Are you Schumann. what's her name now? I am. That's <laughs> I love it. I'm good with what's her name. What's her name? No, I was sadly <laughs> yeah. a film I got holy major. elixir. Oh, I what do I do with that? Alright, thank you for coming. Oh, thank you for yeah. I. Holy elixir. Because I didn't follow through in our blood work then. No. So that's alright. I'm going to see that actually this week. Do it. Yes. And then I'm going to see it again next week. Supplies. So, you can see it with me. What's the holy elixir do? Uh. Can I drink it? Hit X for check. Shot, 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 shot. Boost your health and slayer power. Okay. Sadly, a filthy future book title. <laughs> yeah, no. Keep that, because I'm really bad at writing titles. So, if I ever do write a book or a memoir, a that should be the title. Yeah. You can also just call me Chell or Shell or however you want to pronounce that from the portal. Since I have my Stuart. On. Stuart. <laughs> That's why that I choose to pronounce correct. that. It's pronounced Frank. Frank. Right. <laughs> I always thought shell is in short for Michelle. Michelle? Yeah. That's what I, thought. I think that's I what it is. Shells, but other people say shell, and I don't know. Well, oh, they're dumb. City monsters. Right. Oh. Oh. Don't just think like also, shell as in like she's a shell of a person. Like I thought God, like Valve was being ready to creative there with that or something. Whoopi Goldberg's worst of titles, her audio. Well, that's what I'd call an autobiography. I you have to read the whole quote or else the stream won't go. Sorry. Oh, Whoopi Goldberg is worst of titles. Her autobiography was called book. <laughs> Which isn't strictly wrong, but... <laughs> Cat cards is what? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> what? 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 So if they turn it into a movie, it'd be book the movie. I love oh it. Oh my god, yes. Book the video <laughs> game? Okay, book okay the now. Game. Book the Memorpaga. No, I, I see what she was doing there, and I like it. I book like it the lot. graphic novel. Book the audiobook. Book on ice. <laughs> All right, so Bentoff. right now you really need to be opening up the donation thing in a browser tab and also probably looking at the rankings and seeing, do I want to change this wheel in any way for the wheel spin that is happening in four, six minutes, pretty much five by the time you hear this. Yeah, rankings. And on, on another note of Whoopi Goldberg, uh, Can't Wear Hats recommends book, the video game, the movie, the book. There you go. How much on a cruise ship was sponsored by her? To burn Sorry? this game. How much is what? Do I need to donate to burn this game? <laughs> to burn it? <laughs> I think you're doing quite well. What you need to do is donate for everything but it. For like but. five. Five dollars to everything but it. But I want it to be on fire. <laughs> <laughs> um, so right now, the top five, we have the mystery game. Oh, no. Hannah Montana. Rystar the Shooting <laughs> Star. Steel Battalion. And Super Metroid. Nice. So, okay. if that's We're not to your liking, player. you need to go There's donate right now for what you want. Yeah. And a twenty-five dollar donation to any game would put it in number four. You just got raked. Hey, we're raking in the kills. Yeah. So that guy should you leave because <laughs> he raked leaves with it. Right? Uh, yeah, don't forget the trademarks, Can't Wear Hats. It needs to be like book trademark, the video game trademark, the movie uh, trademark, yeah. the book trademark. Registered, copyright. Hey, you don't treat women like that! <laughs> 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 the bunny. Are you just poking her? Is that a broom? What do you have now? A shovel? No, it's that, that's a rake. Oh, a rake. Did you, oh, hear, did you hear a great puns a minute ago? Were you not listening? You have to pick up the stick part of it. It's on the ground now. No, no, you got it. All right. I like that. Yeah, it breaks. Time to move on. 
If you're not sure what game to donate for, Shuman yeah. says, you could donate to GoldenEye or Sonic and Knuckles. Those are excellent games and everyone enjoys them. GoldenEye is always a blast. I Dead. enjoy them. Dead. And like I said, let's say $30 to either of those would put it in number four and give someone clean water for life. What a deal. What's that meter at the top? Can I go like Super Saiyan? Um, yeah, I think so. I think your Slayer Super power Slayer. is like, yeah. You're, yeah, that's like you have a combo one at the tippy top. I don't know what that does. But it's definitely counting how many hits you get in. Do we have the manual for this game? Because we really need to figure yeah, this out. Sure. I mean, we only have a few minutes left of this, but this is important. Yeah, you got 13 minutes. She just said, oops, I did it again. That is a uh, song that I love. <laughs> Um, Jimmy, where'd he go? Jimmy, the manual is right there. Oh, hey, we found it. We found it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> we did it, everyone. It's literally right there. And Schumann <laughs> made an NPR joke. <gasps> Crazy if donkey. you donate thirty dollars to Goldeneye or Sonic, you will also receive our golf umbrella with a picture of our classic <laughs> tote bag. <laughs> Uh, Rice Star is fun, I promise it is. Donate for that one, says Hunto. Is this the key master or the gatekeeper? Uh, okay, so um, your Slayer power is top left, the purple thing. Okay. Your health meter is okay. below that, but you already knew that. On the right is the enemy health meter. Um, so, Monsta is back. Monsta, what do you want to see Nighthawk here play? And you uh, got just a few minutes to donate. Monsta Three hours, Greg V is up. Oh yeah, you you in particular might want to hold off for that if you're on a budget. A pile at fourteen. You know, yeah, I yeah. Start thinking, was, Monsta, and anyone else about also what you'd like to see Greg Z play for the Finale. final shift. <laughs> what do we want to end with for our last four games with uh, DJ Greg Z? Apparently, I'm going to need a plan B. Oh, Monster left. Probably because he saw Greg Z wasn't playing yet. Monster. <laughs> Refresh. No Greg Z. I'm out. Or it was the Buffy. Ah. <laughs> uh, you know, Nighthawk. Wow, there's light in there. That's crazy. Just kill the vampires. That's what you're here to do. I killed the key master. I killed them. Oh, you killed the dog? Yeah. That oh, you're fast. Than me. Nice job. You're doing better than me. You're winning. I don't know that you're doing better than Grant when he played. Well, okay, that was. He's, he's less distracted by Buffy uh, trivia bouncing around in his head. Uh, yes. That's why I never do well at Star Wars games. I'm like, mm, no. this is a T65 X Wing? What is this? Okay. Got two proton torpedo suits? Oh, he's Yes, Grant can't remember this any trivia. He's too distracted wanted, by go it. Go home. <laughs> She's scared like, of the vampires. I've seen all of Buffy and Angel. Yes, you have, I promise. I was there. All right. What's a Buffy? Yeah. <laughs> Jokes at home. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good like, point. oh right, all forms of entertainment are paying to watch someone else do something. Yep. <laughs> well, that's, that's not like oh gosh, prostitution. Not, not all. Okay, most passive Going entertainment. All basement. forms of passive entertainment are, by definition, in some way, paying to watch someone else do something. Uh oh, Stephanie. It seems we've swam through the deep waters of philosophy. <laughs> I think and it's also, time for a wheel spin. It is. So do I spin it this way or that way? Just checking. I don't know. I'm in the basement. Counterclockwise. Where's the power of the As I'm looking at it this way, counterclockwise? Hold, yes. okay. spin up from the bottom. Yes, like that. Okay. Ready, don't you guys? Do don't do it yet. We're double checking. Uh, oh, no okay. new donations. So, really quick Mystery Game, Hannah Montana, Rise Star, Steel Battalion, Super Metroid. Spin that wheel. <laughs> Okay, Hannah Montana. Hannah Montana, let's do it. Yeah. Oh, come on, give it a man 
Should I give it? Should I give another spin? Man or? spin. Man spin. Man, man spin. spin. Before any of us look and see. Man what spin. It is. Okay. Man, man spin. Man spin. Yeah. <laughs> That's a mystery game. <gasps> mystery oh! game. All right. All right. Ooh. Billy, you can take no, a short break. Off. Or sorry. Uh, who's Billy? Um. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Billy. Nighthawk. 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 Nighthawk.
<laughs> what do you want? What do you want me to call you? See, um. <laughs> and this is an excellent reminder that, mm. like, telling your parents, please donate to this charity uh -huh. thing that I like, it works. Thanks, mom and dad. <laughs> We highly recommend the ask your parents to do it method <laughs> of donating. Even if you're not, you know, on our on our group here. Right, you can just ask your parents. Ask anyone's parents. Oh wait. I, uh, I type my message as another recipient. That's not how you do that. It's like that Nickelodeon. If you're under 18, get a parent's permission. Oh, my goodness. That's true, though. Don't just, like steal your parent's credit card and donate. Yeah, we, we do not ask them. that. Ask them. They'll probably donate more than you would have. <laughs> you know, like, five bucks is good. And parents are like, charity? I can tax deduct that. One hundred. <laughs> Just walk into a house and ask to see their parents and ask them to donate. Or Correct. Knock on doors. Excuse me, young child. Oh my, I'd like to have a talk with them about charity and video games. Right. <laughs> like money. Not for UNICEF, but for charity water. Also, Steel Battalion. <laughs> Nothing to this electrician game. Actually, he might, that, that might be the one he votes for. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I turned the power on and everything blew up. Well, that's exciting. Uh, Lee suggests Fatal Frame 2 as the game you could pick for this uh, very generous donation. Or Jimmy, you could spread the wealth. I yes. could. It could I be, could. Um, uh, you could. Seriously, like, that kind of money could put tons of games on. Lichi, I gotta say, um, I hated Fatal Frame. It scared me a lot. I pretended to be brave, but I was terrified. That's How true. much do I need to donate to play... Royal Rumble for Sega Genesis for the rest of the day. <laughs> With, Jimmy. <Victoria. laughs> With Jimmy. <laughs> That's true though, Jimmy. We have a Frames lot of games tall. that have <laughs> not Frames seen the light tall. of day on the wheel. So if you want to <laughs> make a new top five you know, I, in your hands. I, I think we might do that here. We'll see what he what he gets back to me with. Sure. But, uh, I think it's going to be... I want that animal to do thing. What? No. <laughs> no. Just um, your moves get more crazy when you get those power up. Let me, uh, let me get back into this thing real quick. Because it, it is called Super Slayer. You get Super Slayery. Uh, let's see here. Options, game screen, punch. Slayer moves. Uh, some attacks may be boosted with a mysterious force known as Slayer Power. Uh, to add Slayer Power to move, press and hold the desired attack button. A glow surrounds you and indicates the fight move causes greater damage. Okay. So you can execute many, many, many Slayer moves, experiment during fights, and discover them all. Then there's the Super Slayer moves, which are... Da -da -da -da. Oh, you'll learn that later. Okay. When you, you add pages to your Slayer journal. I don't think we're going to get that far. Maybe not, but maybe next time. Open. Wow, there's not that many levels. Actually, no, there's a lot of levels. 13, 13 levels. All right, it's almost time to switch over. Two zombies ain't my neighbors. There it is. That's it. That's All right, it. that's game. Let's say goodbye to vampires and yep. hello to zombies. <laughs> My friends. <laughs> this is the uh, horror game block so far. Look at the spooky. She's like, that's spooky block. Whatever. I don't care what happens to my friends. Yeah, Montana's spooky. Right. Hopefully that comes up. Goodbye. So, um, Nighthawk, what did you learn from Buffy? Have you learned any big, big, valuable life lessons? Um, from this uh, golden-haired slayer of uh, the undead? If I see this game, I know not to play it. Okay, that's good. You didn't have any fun at all? Because um, it seemed like you, you, you felt a bit of accomplishment when you when you uncovered the block move. Just because I got to like, share it with you. Yeah. So mm -hmm. We were together. That's all we had. And that's all that matters. No, And no fatal frame, or frame fatale, as I'm now going to call it forever. Frame fatale. Oh, sorry. Sometimes when people are off screen, they motion to me. I don't know what they're saying, so I ignore them. So I've stopped doing that. Yeah. I just do things now. Yeah, it just happens. Uh, oh, Ben Toch left before I could tell him I liked his name. He'll never know now. Mm. Someone tell him. Buffy was the reason about an Xbox. You know, there's always that, that sort of watershed game that pushes you over the top one way or the other. For me, it was Rogue Squadron. That's why I got a GameCube. Rogue Squadron 2. Rogue Leader. 
Put that as well. Followed by Rogue Squadron, Squadron 3, Rebel Strike. I think I'm mixing my game titles up. That's right. Sounds good. I like it. That's what I'm calling them now. Yeah. Was <gasps> I playing Razor? We were. I was, actually. It was delightful. Uh, the monkey scream is very interesting when the one falls off a cliff. There's cliffs you can fall off of. Most of the levels, oddly enough, take place, you know, thousands of feet in the air. And you skate around on these floating skate parks and fall to your death and scream. It's a lot of fun. I just have to say, Jimmy, I, for a split second, I thought that your feet shoes were Nintendo Power Gloves that you were wearing as slippers. How great would that be? Aren't these And great? I'm just thinking, you know, we talk a lot about... Nintendo Power Shoes. Ability and, They're you know. so bad. <laughs> Well, no, um, I, apparently Twitch isn't big on uh, bare feet, so I figured, well, what's, you know... As did I, brought yeah. my own footwear. So what's the, uh, what's the closest I can get to bare feet? And it's uh, toe shoes with... Careful. Oh, oh with, we're getting with, close. With, with... Ugh, oh, two socks <laughs> underneath. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you thought they were regular socks. No, the, the, you were wrong. This is the lingerie of socks. <laughs> <laughs> it's dropping like one of your French oh, socks. God, it smells terrible. Why did you do that? I don't know. I just <laughs> my cat does it. Where's my game? When I pop the shoes off and get home. So uh loading is happening now. Oh my gosh, this oh. looks amazing. Looks like we are just about ready to get started. Yeah. I so, remember this. Plus one for better. toe socks, yes. If we could all donate one dollar for uh, what's a good game that involves toe socks? <laughs> you know what? I don't think I could drive a Mac without toe socks. So everyone, everyone, donate one dollar for toe socks to uh, um, Dance Dance Revolution. Steel Battalion. Oh, we're playing together. Looks like we got some yeah. man. chance for two player. Okay, I haven't heard, heard back from the old man yet. So, uh, oh, I think we like started. It looks like no, it was no, on. Uh, oh. Yeah, you're ready to go. There's more to do. Oh. Just dance for a little while. Yeah, I think the best part for me about this marathon is the older games that we play, you just totally forget about their soundtracks. And sometimes they're like surprisingly catchy tunes. Like, this is pretty fun. Commando was, was a lot of fun, too. That was a... Uh... Catchy. Weirdly enough, Hello Kitty, the puzzle game, wasn't bad. <laughs> like it had just a pretty, uh, like, I mean, it was a loop, of course, but it was pretty, pretty good. Just as far as like smarmy kind of elevator electronic music sort of thing. Uh, this is a, a quick math problem on the board here. Toe socks are better than every socks. Thank you, Schumann Whoa. 3D Blast. I don't know. What about those? Oh, Konami. Like sweater socks that are have like tread on the bottom. <laughs> Or like Tabby, do those kind of socks or slippers? <laughs> it's just getting there. Socks of the world by you pick. Oh, we're three. Yeah. We're gonna stream this too. 